Hello and welcome to One Word Podcast, the most unpredictable podcast in the world. I am here today with Corey. Hi, Corey. Hi. Uh, what can you tell us about yourself, Corey? Um, I wash dishes for a living and make coffee. <laughs> wow, you are really not selling that well. Can you... Uh, <laughs> I'm the owner of Liberty Cafe. Which is... It's 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 good stuff. If you guys are in uh, Northeast Wisconsin ever, check out Liberty Cafe. Good stuff, right? Um, so, do you know how this works? No. <laughs> it's always fun. <laughs> I was uh, just told to come in here nope. after work. <laughs> well, here's how this is going to work. We have a random word generator. And uh, what happened was just right before we started, I was given a list of two words that were created using this random word generator. Okay. You're going to choose one of them, and that's going to be the topic of this podcast. Okay. We're just going to talk about that word. And uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> These words are um, interesting. I can't control them. You know, they're random. So your two words that you get to choose from are gunk. <laughs> okay. Gunk. Oh, it gets worse. Okay. Yes. Okay. It gets worse. And pervert. <laughs> pervert. <laughs> Pick your poison. I'll choose gunk. Oh. oh. <laughs> so why not pervert? <laughs> Do you just not want to get in trouble? I don't know. I just chose gunk. You went with your gut. Is your gut filled with gunk? No. Huh? Gunk free since yesterday. For, for, yeah. Since this morning. Oh. <laughs> Before you took a shower. <laughs> All right. So we're going to talk about the word gunk. Okay. Seems like a weird word to talk about, but we're doing it. So what does the word gunk mean to you? Gunk sounds like buildup of. Something in a crevice. <laughs> that was that was oddly specific. <laughs> I don't know if you're referring to a specific thing or just like that's what your brain relates to. I don't know. Like if you haven't cleaned your bathroom in a long time and you have buildup of mildew in between the cracks of your or like on the edges of your shower where the tile meets, mm -hmm. it's called gunk. <laughs> it's gunk, I guess. All right. I mean, that's fair. That is fair. <laughs> Do you have issues with gunk in your house? It's probably a little gunk around my bathroom sink. Maybe you should clean it. I know. I in fact, know. let's stop the episode. <laughs> Go home. Clean out that gunk. Come on. Gunk. <laughs> I... That is one fun word to say, don't you think? Gunk. I have I have used it before in sentences. Can you use it in a sentence? Um, clean the gunk out from between from underneath your fingernails. <laughs> <laughs> is there gunk in your fingernails? Oh, nope, mine are clean. Mine are Do clean dishes too. all day. Oh, that that's probably a good point. <laughs> so you always have squeaky clean hands. Yep. Um, a thousand times a day. You know, one thing I think of with gunk is uh, I always see commercials where like, use this oil and get the gunk out of your car's engine. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that too. Do you use oil to get the gunk out of your car? Or however that... I don't know cars. <laughs> I guess I change the oil so the gunk doesn't build up. Okay. I, 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 I do Am not I know how to drive or anything like that. I don't know how cars work. I know you stick the key in and turn it and it just goes vroom. <laughs> So uh, I know oil is part of it, but I don't really know why. Uh, it's not my thing. Okay. Do you regularly get your oil changed? Yes. Justin's actually getting his oil changed right now. All right. So oil changes are think, important, right? What are, happens if your engine from building up gunk? Gunk. <laughs> what happens if there's too much gunk in your car? Your pistons could seize and your car will stop running. That doesn't sound very good. No. I don't want my seizing pistons. So. <laughs> you don't want your pistons seizing. No. No, it does not sound like anything I'm interested in. I am not buying any of that. Gunk. How do you talk about gunk? How? It's oh. gunk. How long does this have to be? Six hours. 
I forgot to tell you, it's a marathon Rich. podcast. <laughs> yep. So uh, the way we're going to do that is, well, <laughs> gong. <laughs> so my next question for you, what is the opposite of gunk? Squeaky clean. Squeaky clean. Do you normally keep things squeaky clean? At the store, probably not at home as much. Okay. Uh, do you consider yourself a neat freak? Mm, not neat, I guess. Organized. Uh, okay. All right, so organized. is there any gunk in your cafe? Not that I know of. I'm sure there is somewhere. <laughs> but... <laughs> Would you like to keep it clean? We like to keep it nice and clean. All right, there you have it. Shut down. <laughs> well, we don't want that. We need our uh, fix of espresso. <laughs> espresso. 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 That is correct. <laughs> Not espresso. <laughs> Man, I feel bad for myself right now for saying that. <laughs> you came down to me. You're like, it's espresso. Espresso. <laughs> oh, excuse me, sir. Did you just say espresso? <laughs> oh. oh, oh. <laughs> Uh, I'd love to throw the word gunk in there somewhere, but I can't. <laughs> Got to clean the espresso machine daily so gunk doesn't build up. All right. And uh, is that hard work or easy? I don't know. Hannah does it every day. <laughs> <laughs> so she's like, you employee, go over there and clean out the gunk. <laughs> exactly. Now she just does it. I have her trained well. <laughs> All right. So... Do you have any final words on the word gunk? Gunk is disgustingly gross. What's gross about it? Just the word, or the fact that it is gunk or the contents of the gunk? Well, the contents could be many things, but... <laughs> uh, uh, let's not take the time to list them. This is... That shit sailed. We don't want to be perverts here. <laughs> I see what you did there. Uh. It's uh, warm in here. <laughs> it must be the lights. <laughs> yeah, we do have some uh, pretty bright lights on so we can see over here because this is our video set that we're on. <laughs> um, thanks for coming on the show. Seriously, talking about thanks gunk. Thanks for asking me. Yeah, gunk's pretty cool. Just uh, I hope this gunk's episode cool, wasn't man. gunk. <laughs> um, if you guys listening to this episode want to suggest words for us to use in this podcast, you can find us on Facebook. You can go to our website, www.gunk. No, I mean uh, <laughs> www.onewordpodcast.com for more episodes. Corey, are you going to watch all the episodes? I'm going to listen to them. Oh, oops. <laughs> <laughs> I keep saying watch because I'm so used to some of our other content that's on video. Yeah. And it, I, I like for months I trained my brain to always say watch, mm -hmm. and now that's not the case, and it's driving me nuts. Mm -hmm. So uh, if you guys ever hear me say watch, referring to this show, just 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 swap it out with listen in your head. Don't gunk it all up. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thanks for coming on again. Uh, uh, you. you did bring the free espresso, right? I did not bring no, any espresso. But you did bring some espresso, <laughs> right? Yes. <laughs> all right. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for listening to this episode, and I'll see you next time with more words. Bye. <laughs>